this kind of choke or any kind of attack on the arm or on the neck here. It's very, very tricky if the person is squared onto you like this. So when you do this, look, you notice that my hip went slightly to the side. Just a tiny bit is enough to make sure that the rest is going to go well. So I'm not squared up by them like that. Pull your arm out. It comes out real easy and quick. I can't hold it. Now I'm going to have to, if that happens, let go, slide over again. Huh? Look. To the side, reach. And then hug. Because he's going to try to stand up now. And you hug. Don't forget to make a good grip, usually here. You can't, I've seen a lot of this happen. They hold like this with the fingers. And then as you come around, the grip loosens up and you can't secure it. So it's extremely important that when you hold here, you kind of squeeze, see, squeeze, move. I did not let go of my grip, it's the same. Because as he's moving, if I let go, it's going to loosen up and I can't get that. I won't have a second chance. I only have one. So you're here. Look, stick here, squeeze. See the thing about the second hand? It has to be tight. And when he goes around, that tightness stays. And your elbow does not go up. It goes in. Does that make sense? Of course. Come on. 